Welcome to pre-math. In this video, we have got this uh, trapezoid uh, A, B, C, D that consists of these uh, two triangles. The white uh, right triangle uh, A, B, D and the green shaded uh, triangle uh, B, C, D. As you can see in this given diagram, such that uh, this uh, side uh, A, B length is 10 cm. And the area of this uh, white uh, triangle uh, is uh, 100 centimeter square. And moreover, uh, this side uh, AD equal to this side uh, CD. And furthermore, uh, these uh, angles are our 90 degrees angles. And now our task is uh, to calculate the area of this uh, green shaded triangle uh, BCD. Please don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe. And please keep in mind that this figure may not be 100% true to the scale. Let's go ahead and get started. And here's our very first step. Let's focus on this uh, white right triangle uh, ABD. And we know the area of this triangle has been given to us as 100. And this side length uh, is uh, 10 centimeter. And now we are going to figure out uh, this side uh, AD length. So therefore, let's recall the area of a triangle formula. Area is always equal to a half times base times the height of the triangle. And we know the base of this uh, triangle uh, is uh, AD, whereas the height uh, is uh, 10 centimeter. And the area has been given to us as 100. Let's go ahead and fill in the blanks in this uh, formula. So the area of this triangle is uh, 100 equals to a half uh, times. I'm going to write down the height first, which is uh, 10 times uh, our uh, base is uh, a d length. And now we know that uh, 1 divided by 2 times 10 is going to give us uh, 5. So therefore, I could write uh, 5 times uh, a d length is going to be equal to 100 and now i'm going to divide both sides by 5 to isolate ad this is gone so therefore uh, our side length uh, a d turns out to be 20 centimeter so therefore we could see that this uh, a d side length uh, is uh, 20 centimeter and now we know that uh, this uh, CD length uh, equal to this uh, AD length. If this is uh, 20 centimeter, then CD length has got to be 20 centimeter as well. And now we are going to focus on this uh, green shaded uh, triangle uh, BCD. And we are interested in calculating the area of this uh, green shaded triangle uh, BCD. And now let's recall the area of a triangle formula once again. Area equals to a half times base times the height. And in our case, uh, the base uh, of this uh, green shaded triangle is uh, this uh, BC length. Whereas uh, the height uh, of this uh, green shaded triangle is going to be this uh, AB length, which is uh, 10 centimeter. So therefore, now our only task is uh, to calculate uh, this uh, base uh, BC length. And in this uh, next step, I have dropped this uh, perpendicular DE on this uh, base BC. And now let's make an observation. We can see that this uh, perpendicular DE is the height uh, of this uh, green shaded triangle uh, BCD. And the height uh, of this uh, green triangle is uh, 10 uh, centimeter. So therefore, uh, this uh, DE length turns out to be 10 centimeter. And now we are going to focus on this uh, right triangle uh, CED. And in this uh, triangle, uh, this uh, side uh, CE length uh, is uh, unknown. So therefore, we are going to calculate uh, this uh, side CE length by using the Pythagorean uh, theorem. And here's our Pythagorean theorem, a square plus b square equal to c square. And in our case, uh, the hypotenuse for this uh, triangle is uh, 20 centimeter, whereas uh, this uh, leg is 10 centimeter. Let's go ahead and fill in the blanks in this uh, Pythagorean formula. So we got uh, our side uh, ec length square 
plus b square is going to be 10 square equal to our hypotenuse is 20 square and now we are going to subtract 100 from both sides this is gone so therefore uh, ec square value is going to be equal to 300 and now i'm going to undo this uh, square by taking a square root on both uh, sides so therefore this uh, square and square root undo each other so we are going to get uh, our ec length is going to be equal to and now let's focus on this uh, square root of 300 this could be written as square root of uh, 100 times the square root of 3 and we know square root of 100 is 10 and then times the square root of 3 so therefore our ec length turns out to be 10 times the square root of 3 centimeter so thus our this ec length is going to be 10 times the square root of 3 and now let's make an observation we can see that this uh, BE length is going to be equal to this base uh, AD length and this is uh, 20 centimeter so therefore we conclude that this uh, BE length is going to be 20 centimeter as well so therefore uh, this whole base BC length uh, is going to be the sum of these two individual lengths 20 plus uh, 10 times square root of 3 so therefore we could write uh, 20 plus uh, 10 times the uh, square root of 3 centimeter and here's our final step now we are going to calculate uh, the area of this uh, green shaded triangle uh, BCD and let's recall the area of a triangle formula once again it is equal to a half times base times the height of the triangle and in our case uh, the base uh, of this uh, triangle turns out to be 20 plus 10 times square root of 3 whereas the height of this triangle is 10 so therefore uh, this green shaded area is going to be equal to a half uh, times uh, i'm going to write down the height first uh, 10 times uh, the base is uh, 20 plus uh, 10 times uh, square root of uh, 3 and now we can see 1 divided by 2 times 10 reduces to simply 5 so therefore this is going to be equal to 5 times 20 plus 10 times square root of 3 and now I am going to distribute 5 so therefore that is going to give us 100 plus 50 times square root of 3 centimeter square the area of this green shaded triangle BCD so thus the area of this uh, green shaded triangle uh, turns out to be 100 plus uh, 50 times square root of 3 centimeter square and that is going to be approximately equal to 186.6 uh, centimeter square as well so therefore uh, the area of this uh, green shaded triangle is going to be 100 plus 50 times square root of 3 centimeter square and that's our final answer thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos bye